oil. In the vast landscape of Kajado County, where the beauty of nature clashes with the harsh realities of climate change, a group of resilient Maasai women pastoralists face a daunting challenge. Prolonged drought threatens not only their traditional way of life, but also the survival of their families and livestock. But the women are now embracing a new strategy that is revolutionizing their lives. Zakari Nyakweba reports on the Women Cow Policy Plan, an annual rotational program which entails standard cash sharing as a means of livelihood. A group of determined women from Olkaramatian, Olkeri, Shompole and Oldenyonyoke group ranches in the interior Kajado West constituency have registered as groups and embarked on a communal empowerment project. The women, who have been in the past collecting and selling scrap metals to Tata Chemicals, formed the initiative dubbed Women Cow Policy, which involves 200 women getting 5 million shillings for empowerment initiatives. <laughs> women who gathered at Magadi to receive the cash broke into song and dance. They are now slowing recovering from the effects of adverse weather that saw families lose livestock. Sisi tumepata faida kwa sababu ya hii kambuni sana. Na si hii peke yake. Hata sasa hii watoto wetu wanapata school fees kwa sababu ya Tata Chemical. Kwa hivyo Tata Chemical na wamama ama na community ya Magadi tumeshikana tumekuwa pamoja nao kwa sababu wanatusaidia sana. Mimi natarajia nikipata hii pesa najua ni 1030 nikipata naenda kusukuma watoto wangu wa college. Kuna kijana wangu wa college ameenda leo hapo ana tikiti, hapo ana pesa sasa nikipata naenda kumtumania. Previously, the women individually collected tons of scrap metals from soda ash manufacturer Tata Chemicals Company, but the exercise exposed women to risk. The company changed tact and instead sold the scrap metals on their behalf thrice per year. Chief of the community is involved. They come up with the names, they just give the company names so that then uh, this is paid out uh, through a um, cooperative society. And those who can then be able also to join the cooperative society and form several groups can also benefit and even eventually, um, if they want, can take loans from the cooperative uh, society. Tunajaribu kuhakikisha kwamba kila mama mepata hela zake kwa kuangalilia kwamba ID zao zinaambatana na jina ambaye tumepewa na kampuni na kwa wale ambaye hawawezi kujisajilisha kama signature hivi kwa sababu ya kutojua kusoma wanafinya kidole kama vile tunavyofinya wakati wa weka muhuri mahali The project is aimed at empowering women and people living with disabilities identified by the local registration Zakari Nyakweba NTV Nairobi